If you thought we were never going back to Snake Pass, well, you were wrong. We're going to World 2 today. Uh, Gatekeeper Gardens is where I'm at, and I need to replay the fourth level again. Because it doesn't save the way I thought it does, and okay. Let me do that. Okay, Creeping Causeway is done, and now we're going to go to Crooked Canal in Saw Gee's Realm. Aw, uh, yeah, it's Snake Pass on the Nintendo Switch. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Brian here for a level N. It's uh, Snake Pass. I didn't think we'd ever, ever, ever come back. But you know what? We're here. We're here playing Snake Pass, and we're going to play the second world, allegedly, if we manage to actually uh, uh, beat the level and not fail at it and not... Uh, oh, we can dive underwater and not completely mess it up. So let's see. Let's dive underwater here. Snakes can... I don't know if they can normally swim underwater. I think some variants of snakes can, some different... Uh, some different species of snakes. I know there's like river snakes that can be a thing. I don't know if garden snakes can, but your typical uh, cobra and such like that cannot. Can confirm they cannot. Um, not typically a thing snakes are able to do. So, yeah. Okay, so what we need to do is get this switch. No pun intended. Actually, every pun intended. Don't fall. There we go. Uh, no, don't fall. There we go. Uh, we need to activate this switch to activate the other thing so that we can uh, uh, do what we need to do properly. How do I activate the switch? Do I pull? Oh, yes, I do. I constrict it, and then it actually ends up working. Cool. So I've only played, I think, up to actually this point. I got to the first level of level two. And then I think I just stopped playing on my own. I didn't complete this game on my own. So, like, everything that we're going to be exploring in this episode is going to be completely brand new. Beside the opening part of this level. So this stuff I've already seen. But everything else, to my knowledge, I have not seen. I might have seen, like, different, uh, different gameplay situations, but, uh... I haven't actually played it, so that's good. Um, they haven't done any real updates since the last time we saw this game. It's just, uh, you know, it's just Snake Pass. It's, you're using the snake to go from point A to point B. I guess he does get some more abilities as we go along here, but I don't know how dramatically that will change the gameplay at all. So we will have to wait and see. Is that, where, okay, so I saw, Again, in case you, you didn't know, you need to get three pieces of the, the end portal. There's three little sections that we can see. One of them is uh, purple up there, the other one is orange, and it's way back over there. Okay, cool. Um, I don't know what this does. Oh, it's a puzzle. And we need to push it to the hole, right? That probably unlocks something that I need. Yes, indeed it does. Cool. So now we can actually get up there. So yeah, I've gotten a little bit better with the controls. It hasn't been, it it's not a very hard game to figure out as soon as you can get up here and master the controls of it. Uh, it you know, you just gotta get used to it. And I've said that in my previous video I did as well. I did a complete playthrough of the first world in Snake Pass all in one go. That's how short it can be. You know, if you don't go for every single little thing underneath here and all around, you can get through the levels pretty quickly. So that's what we're going to do. You know, I'm not going to explore every single little part because I don't want to spend an hour in each level doing that. Because if you really wanted to, you could totally do that. You could spend a solid hour exploring all these different regions and regions and stuff can I how do I what is this I don't know what that is it's uh, there's a switch I probably have to unlock but I don't know where that would be uh, is it on the other side up there maybe is it on the other side down below I don't know 
Does this have something to do with it up here? Yes, it does. It's a switch. Or it's a lever, rather. So, I guess we coil around this and drag it this way? Yeah, that's exactly what we need to do. Just located right across the way there. Uh, that changed... I don't know how much. It doesn't seem like it did much, but I'm gonna go ahead and assume it did... Ah, oh, okay. Does this drum do anything? No? The drum does absolutely nothing, can confirm. Can I go underneath here? Yes, I can now. Cool. And what about... What about now? Can I go over here? Yes, I can. Over to this side. So getting from point A to point B can be pretty difficult if you don't know exactly what you're doing. Uh, the controls are... They're okay. They're not the absolute best. And I know I said I wasn't going to do all the different levels, and, and or rather, do all the different... Uh, uh, gems so you collect three of these gems right here and then you go toward the end of the end of the level and then you actually beat the level and that's all you really have to do now you can get those other two um, two collectibles per level there's the blue blue orb things and there's also like five different gold coins you can collect you can get all that stuff now from what I what I know in Snake Pass, you getting each of those blue orbs or the gold coins doesn't actually do anything. So even like you getting these three gems at the end of the level, Crooked Canal is complete. You getting each of these three gems, it doesn't, it completes the level for you, but it doesn't actually unlock anything. It doesn't, it, it just doesn't. Like there's no achievement system, there's no secret reward there's no secret level it's just hey collect this stuff and that's it so it's kind of in the vein of banjo and kazooie in the sense that it is a very collectible based game but if you don't actually get anything for doing it it takes a lot of the incentive away to actually do it so let's see where our gems are this time can we see them from over here it doesn't look like it camera move cooperate it doesn't look like they're around here. Okay, so let's go this way. And we will see exactly where this stuff is around here. So the gold coins, I think, are a little bit harder to get. The blue ones are... There's just a lot of them. Like, the gold ones are the harder ones. The blue ones, there's just a bunch of them hidden all throughout the map. That could easily kill me right there. Those spikes are not good. I'm just going to go this way. Thank you. Gonna avoid all of that nonsense. I see a green up here. Ooh, and it's rotating. So the additional challenge of movement. I see all three. I see all three gems located right around here. I'm gonna activate this checkpoint. So we should go green, obviously, first. I'm just gonna go along here. Yep, I'm gonna avoid all of that noise. And we're just gonna go up here. My controller is vibrating ever so slightly. It's that HD rumble on the Nintendo Switch Pro controller. We got that. Yeah, that was easy. Okay, cool. Still in the fairly easy category. Go, 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 go. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. No death today. So how do I get over there? Oh, I have to use that to get over there. I can't just like fly over I don't well I just activated the checkpoint I'm gonna risk it YOLO nope I'm not gonna make it nope 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 go over here go over here there we go okay not even close no way we were gonna make that okay let's go over here get our dragonfly buddy out of the way was well, a dragonfly bunny and then our uh, hum a hummingbird buddy don't want to risk either of them getting further hurt at all I missed that entirely Activate that checkpoint here, and we gotta go down. Let's explore the deep depths of uh, so Soggy. Soggy. Nice pun on Soggy, I suppose. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Mr. Snake. Mr. Snake. Where are we going? Let's go this way. We'll, we'll break the barriers a little bit. Can I? Nope, I died. Okay. Oops. 
How about if we go this way instead? We'll see what's over here and go up the actual way that we're supposed to go instead of risking it for no reason and no benefit whatsoever. Can I coil around here? Let's go. It won't let me coil because the water is just not complying with me. Okay, cool. I will go up this way. Go, coil, coil. Okay, we successfully made it up. Now we need to go up here. So can I, can I maybe, no, I can't go around those. There's no way, because I can't coil straight up onto a thing. I need to actually climb up using these different things over here. So let's get this ball from point A to point B. All difficult puzzles, as you can tell, clear as day here. Uh, uh, can I push it? Push it. Push it real good. Da -na 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 -na. Go. Push. Push. Why are you not pushing? Push the ball. Push it. Or pull it. Pull it. Nope. How do I... How should I do this? I don't... Uh, I don't know. There we go. Okay. Now, move to the left. Nope, nope. What, what are you doing? How are you stuck? How? What? Really? How? Uh, how? I can't get out. I can't get out. I can't get out of this. It's not letting me get out. There's nothing I can do. It's not, it's not, nothing's working. I got glitched into, I got stuck inside of here. Would you look at that? Huh. I am completely 100% stuck. It won't let me. Oh, I got out. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, I don't want to restart the level. I really, really didn't want to restart the level. Where is this ball going? Let's go back over this way. Comply with me. Comply. There we go. Go. Oh, go. Go. There we go. Now over to the right. This is going to take a lot longer than the first episode, I'll tell you that. Uh, what, why am I getting all tangled up? Get over here. To the right. Take it back now, y'all. Oh. Work. Work. There. It's not a difficult process. Just, just push the ball forward to the right. To the left a little bit. The hole is right there. Just put the ball in the hole. Left. Left. Go. Go. You're so close. There we go. Oh, finally. Okay. And now we unlock that one. We can go up there. All that just to get up here. And let's see. Huh. Go. There that is. Let's go up this way. And now the pink gem should be up here, as far as I know. Oh, oh, we could die from the spikes, or we could not, because I'm a pro gamer. Pro gamer, there we go. Oh, there we go. And I'm gonna avoid all of this. I'm just gonna fly to the oh. other side. Fly, snakey, fly. Fly noodle. There we go. Not even paying attention to any of the blue things that are around there to, to collect. Don't even bother. Let's just go and get from point A to point B. And we need to do that by... Nope, I'm not going to make it. Oh, I nearly made it. That was close. Clearly, nope. Not close enough. Nope. Now climb up here. So we're gonna climb up here. We're gonna get this last of the gems here. If it, if Noodle will, no, use your strength. Go, up, up, up. There it is. There it is. Beautiful. Ooh, there's a switch here. Let's activate the switch. Oh, that's exactly what we need to do. Cool. Wow. How did you end up going this way? I didn't tell you to go that way. Up here. 
Now, is the yellow gem up here? No, it must be over here. But I am definitely activating this portal pad right here. I'm not going anywhere else until I have a safe and secure area to uh, to do the thing in. Am I gonna make it? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Sam, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, excellent. So clearly that's the exit. We don't want to go there just yet. We can't until we have the last of our gems. That should be... Maybe over here. No, go back up here. No, no, no. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. Nope. Okay, it's happening. Yep. All right. Let's go. Uh, let's get back up to where we were. Okay, finally. Oh, that took way too long. Oh, that took me like 20 minutes. Oh, okay. Alrighty then. We're gonna go. We're gonna play. I don't know why these pegs are here. I don't need them. Oh no. Is there a checkpoint? There's no checkpoint up here? There's no checkpoint up here. Really? Really? There's no checkpoint. Okay. So, this is gonna make or break the episode, ladies and gentlemen. If I can't pass this part of the level, the video's over. Because I'm not doing that again. It took me 20 minutes one time to get up there. And you know what? I have laundry to do. I have a plane to catch. Like, this is not happening. Ah, uh, it's gonna happen. Yeah, it's gonna happen. Cool. All right, good. I wasn't messing around. I was done. No. I gotta be at the airport at 7.30 in the morning, and I gotta... Did I hear that? I don't know. Did I? Did I meow meow? I don't know, man. There we go. Uh, I, I gotta be there super early because you always gotta be at the airport really earlier than you than you need to be. That's a that's a pro tip for you. Always be at the airport much earlier than you have to be, probably like an hour and a half earlier. But that's gonna do it for this episode. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That's two levels of four, presumably. Lazy Lagoons of Soggy's Realm is complete. I want to thank you guys and girls ladies and gentlemen for tuning in i mean a two-parter for this world and i will see you next time when we play more snake pass on the nintendo switch have a good day and i'll talk to you soon see you later bye